All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give our honor, our praises, our glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakakwadash, Yahweh the Heavenly Father, who the Word only calls God, Yahweh Shai, the only begotten Son, who the Word only calls Jesus Christ. All right. I want to give double honor to the apostles and elders of the Great Millstone and Rule Well. Peace, blessing, grace, and safety goes out to all the Akim around the world, preaching and teaching this word and truth and this sincerity. Shalom to the hopeful elect. All right, so all your call from the Men of Valley, South Carolina camp. And uh, I'm going to come with a lesson, and this is probably going to be titled, uh, None Shall Want Her Mate, you know, because uh, just been meditating, you know, and, uh, you know, reading, uh, seeing what's going on around the world, and all these things that are befalling the earth are, are prophesied in the scriptures, man, all right? So uh, it's just beautiful to be in this knowledge, wisdom, understanding, and uh, a blessing, all right, to have Yahweh Bashim Yashah bestow this knowledge, wisdom, understanding of the scriptures on us. In the correct doctrine, man, because, uh, uh, like I said, the things that are happening uh, around all around the world uh, are prophesied in the scriptures, man. So none shall want her mate, man. No other book is coming. How those scriptures is coming? No other book tells you that uh, there's going to be wars and rumors of wars. All right, uh, pestilence, famines, earthquakes. All right, signs in the heavens. All right, uh, chariots. Um. Uh. Uh, you know, and ultimately, uh, the prophecies that are um, about to come to pass, the ultimate one, uh, uh, the RFID microchip being mandated, which is the mark of the beast and the uh, thermonuclear destruction. All right. That's going to totally destroy Babylon the Great and other various parts uh, of the earth, man. All right. So and I'm just going um, get to the scriptures, you know, don't want to ramble too much. Um, so this is Isaiah 34 and 16. Seek ye out of the book. Of Yahweh and read. All right, what's that? That's the Bible, man. The King James Version 1611 of the Bible, man. All right. It says, No one of these shall fail, none shall want her mate. For my mouth it hath commanded, and his spirit it hath gathered them. Yeah, so none shall want her mate. No other book, all right, no other so called, uh, uh, so-called religious, because it's not a religious, all right, or a spiritual or ho uh, holy book. Not the Quran, the Talmud, all right, the Book of the Dead. None of these things can uh, compare to the scriptures, man, because the scriptures are the truth, man. That's why it says faith is a gift, man. It's a beautiful thing to believe in these words, man. And then you get to seeing them coming to pass, you know, like, oh, this this is everything lines up with the scriptures, man. All right, so none shall want her mate. Nothing is touching this Bible, man. It's, truth is a blessing, all right. <clears throat> All right, Isaiah 34 and 16 again. Seek ye out of the book of Yahweh and read, none of these shall fail, none shall want her mate, for my mouth it hath commanded, and his spirit it hath gathered them. You know? Alright. Um So let's get some more precepts. Alright, none shall want her mate. Because this is scriptures what tell you prophecies, man. Alright? Prophecies. Alright. All right, so can let me move some a little bun down. Still going crazy. All right, um, so lucky. Um, lost my train of thought. Oh yeah, oh the scriptures um have um. The scriptures. Uh, tell prophecies. That's what I was getting into. So lucky, you know, the scriptures prophesy things that's come to pass. So let's get that. Isaiah forty two and nine. Behold, the former things are come to pass, and new things do I declare. Before they spring forth, I tell you of them. All right, and where, where does that happen? Where do these prophecies happen? In the Holy Bible, in the scriptures, man. All right, this book is filled with prophecies. All right, and if you see what's going on in the earth, in the lines where? Right up to the scriptures. That's why none shall want her mate, man. All right, this book tells you prophecies. All right, Isaiah 42 and 9. Behold, the former things are come to pass. All right, those old prophecies have come to pass. The flood, all right, uh, uh, cargo slavery, all right, in America, 70 AD. All right, the crucifixion of our uh, Lord, Savior, Yahweh Shai. Those things are coming to pass. It says, and new things do I declare. All right, so the new things, the, the most I declare in these earthquakes, wars, uh, uh, pestilence, um, and ultimately what? The uh, mandation of the RFID microchip and the nucleus. All right. It says, before they spring forth, I tell you of them. All right, the scriptures, man, the Holy Bible. All right, none shall want her mate. Okay? And, uh, 
Yeah, this thing has nothing but uh, uh, prophecies in it, man. All right, that's why our brothers read these, go out and read these things because these uh, we are commanded to read these prophecies out on the earth to tell people about these prophecies. To try to get our people to repent and try to get ourselves together, man, for your how about you, Yahweh Shah, first and foremost. All right. Second Ezra 15 and 1. Behold, speak thou in the ears of my people the words of prophecy which I will put in thy mouth, said Yahweh. All right. So we're going to speak, we speak into the ears of the people the words of prophecy. All right. And where are the prophecies found? In these scriptures. In these scriptures. All right, Ezekiel 2 and 10, and he spread it before me and was written within and without, and there was written therein lamentations and mourning and woe. And what is Ezekiel talking to? Talking about the scriptures. All right, what was spread before him? That roll. All right, you can go back and read it, you know. Brothers, uh, you know, I already know stuff, but I'm just sticking to the point. All right, well, he, he saw, um, what he saw laid before him was the scriptures and what was, um, uh, written in it, all right? What was written in it? Prophecies, all right? Of lamentation, mourning, and woe. Ezekiel 2 and 10, and he spread it before me, and it was written within and without, and there was written therein lamentations and mourning and woe, all right? So that's what's written in these scriptures, man. That's what's written in these prophecies, all right? And our forefathers uh, uh, prophesied of these things, all right? So, hey, what? None, none shall want his mate. All right, none shall want her mate, Salaki. You know, and what's that her Sophia, the scriptures. All right, the top uh, knowledge, wisdom, understanding on the earth. All right, Jeremiah 28 and 8. The prophets that have been before me and before thee of old prophesied both against many countries and against great kingdoms of war and of evil and of pestilence. All right. And that's the same thing that we are doing now, coming in our forefathers' stead, man. All right? Prophesying. All right? Saying the things that come. And where are these prophecies found now? In the scriptures. All right? The Most High gave our forefathers visions and dreams and things in the men's, uh, and the men seen them that way. All right? And it still happens like that to this day. But where are the prophecies found where we know we can go to them? In the scriptures. That's why none shall want her mate. You know? All right. And all that is uh, due to Yahweh by Shai. All right. Uh, 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 making his word valid. All right. This is the book that is uh, uh, directly connected to Yahweh. Why Yahweh Shai. All right. And that's a beautiful thing. These are the words of the Heavenly Father. All right. And brothers believe that. That's why they take this thing serious. Isaiah 55 and 10, For as the rain cometh down and the snow from heaven, and returneth not thither, but watereth the earth, and make it bring forth in bud, that it may give seed to the sower and bread to the eater, so shall my word that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void, but it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in thy slacking, in the thing whereunto I sent it. All right? And what's the most high, where's the most high words found? In the scriptures. All right. This is where the heavenly father words are at in the holy Bible, man. All right. Call Allah Yahweh by Shimei Asai, you know. So I'm uh, just doing the uh, meditating on that, how none shall want her mate, man. It's a beautiful thing to know what's going on because what the, we know the scriptures and the scriptures prophesy and uh, uh, speak about these things. Okay. Get the last question on the screen. Uh, the Bible uh, speaks about the things that's happening now. All right? So none shall want her mate. Okay? Call her lawyer. How about Shimei Asai? Shalom.